Hey everyone, in this video I want to talk to you about how wisdom doesn't come with age. Yes, I know that that's a very controversial thing to say because a lot of us are raised being told that it does. Children are often told by their parents and other adults that wisdom comes with age. It's almost even a way of silencing children at times because the parents will want to tell them that, hey, I've got all this life experience so you better listen to me. And that is true for the most part. Usually wisdom does come with age because wisdom is a product of life experience and knowledge. But you can actually kind of pursue wisdom consciously if you know what you're doing. You don't need to wait for old age to acquire it. And as we all know, it's not even necessarily a product of old age because we've all likely met older people who aren't wise at all. <laughs> so it doesn't necessarily come with age because we've also met young people who are wise too. So that shows you that you can pursue wisdom at a young age if you just know how to go about it. And the way to do this is to adopt the mantra of knowing that you know nothing and pretty much always pursuing higher learning. Knowing that the best way to grow is to never stop learning new things. You see, the Greeks were on to something when they said that I am wise because I know that I know nothing. That quote, I can't remember if it was Socrates or Plato or Aristotle, one of those guys said it. And it's a great quote because that pretty much is a trait of the wise. They know that their knowledge is limited, so they're always trying to learn new things. And that knowledge, that aspiring to learn as much as possible, is what makes them wise because inevitably they're going to learn a ton of things about life and with that comes the wisdom. So you can actually kind of speed up the acquiring of wisdom by just learning from other people's experiences. Wisdom is a product of life experience and knowledge, but that life experience doesn't necessarily need to be your own. This is a, a lot of the mistake that people make where they assume that in order to be wise, you need a ton of life experience and that it has to be your own. That's not necessarily true because if you want to learn new things or learn different areas of life, oftentimes it's easier to learn from what other people have done than to try and go out there and do all those things on your own. I mean, there's so many things to learn out there and it would be so difficult to learn them all by going out there and doing them all on your own time. I don't think anyone has the time for that. The quickest way to acquire new knowledge is to learn from other people's experience, to read about the mistakes that other people have made, so that way you won't have to go out there and make those same mistakes yourself. You can learn them from other people and then put them into action in your own life. That's what you want to do. So whatever things that interest you, pursue them, become passionate about them, and read up on the people who are in that field and read up about their life experience and all the mistakes they made and especially their philosophy. You want to learn how they thought and why they thought the way they did so that you could know why they made decisions in the way that they did. And if you do this for years, you'll gain a lot of wisdom at a young age because you'll have acquired a lot of life experience by living vicariously through other people, even if those people are no longer alive, and you'll have all of that knowledge from them within you. And you'll have gotten it at a young age. It doesn't matter if you're old or young. You can acquire wisdom at any age if you just pursue knowledge and learning as much as possible. So don't wait until you're old <laughs> to become wise. Start now. Start learning as much as you can. Realize that there never is an end to learning and there shouldn't be. You shouldn't stop learning new things after college or university. That's, that's pointless. You're basically shooting yourself in, your, in the foot if you do that. And there are a lot of people who feel that way where as soon as they're done with university, they're done learning. But if you have that belief, it's really difficult to make your life better because you're not going to actively learn a bunch of things that can help you. So always pursue your own learning. And then with that, you'll gain a ton of life experience and a ton of knowledge at a young age and you can acquire wisdom while being young. Anyway, I hope this video helped you, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Arrivederci!